Air Force pilots, Marine Corps pilots, Navy pilots first learned to fly in. That, my friends, is a PT-17, a Boeing Stearman. We got some music over there. And it's formed by John Moore from St. Paul, Minnesota. This, this is a stock airplane, friends. This does not have a great big air show engine in it. Has a stock 220 horsepower engine set up that Monster 450 most guys put in it. And uh, what John is going to do for you here today is show you the way that pilots were learning how to fly in World War II. And I, you know, and yes, when I started doing air shows, we had general officers and admirals who had started to fly in one of these airplanes. Let me give you an idea of what they're, you know, that they were still in the service. My God, I'm still in the service. I used to fly one of those. Uh, but what John is going to do is show you, this is, the, by the way, the way the Army painted the airplanes for students to fly. And he's going to show you just the way this airplane was flown. Now, you got to remember something. This plane, being stock, does not have any inverted systems in it. What's that mean? Well, Frank, what that means is that the airplane can't stay upside down for any great length of time. Now, what you just saw there is the first half of a Cuban 8. By the way, I was just talking about Chuck Lister. Turn around, turn around, turn around. This is a guy that flies the uh, little jet, and they try to shoot him down. He pretends he's a cruise missile. All right. He just happened to be up here. Uh, what he's flying now is a, a basic uh, aerobatic maneuver. It combines looping and rolling. This is the, uh, the first part of a loop, and then you uh, roll out, go the opposite direction, another half, three quarters of a loop, roll out, and that's called a Cuban 8. Now, this is called a loop. This is a Mark Stormer's loop, and you can see it is perfectly symmetrical. Now he's going to pull. 
Now with the wind behind, he's gonna go like a devil. He's gonna immediately pull that nose back up. He'll roll it upside down. He'll hesitate for just a moment. There he is. Now he holds it upside down. And now he's gonna pull the nose through. Okay, see, now that's it. That's a reverse cubinate. That's a combination of looping and rolling. He sort of turned it inside out. Now what is he here? Oh, he's okay, going straight up now. He's gonna pull this thing up and he's doing a square loop, friends. Now there's no doubt about it. That corner is square. Going across the top, stretching down there. Now it's going. John, here comes the ground, John. And there's that oh, that last pull. And ain't no doubt about it, friends. That is a square loop.